bunnies. And then I'll give them treats through it. <laughs> okay, so here we are at one of our house bunny homes. Here we have a proper pet gate, which you may have to um, put wire over the bars of smaller rabbits, but there's actually a cat flap rabbit hole that you can open up if you want them to enter the rest of your house. So nice gate so the owner can walk around house um, but see what the rabbits are up to and if we go in this is a 19 foot by 12 foot room our minimum space requirement is 10 foot by 6 foot for outside rabbits or for inside rabbits so this is a great size space even if the rabbits don't go around the rest of the house um, <clears throat> We're doing the video because it's so difficult to show house rabbit setups just in photographs. At this end of the room, there are cardboard boxes and tunnels. There's even a little house. And basically, it's like one big warren. You have more cardboard boxes and a whole set of tunnels. So they can go around the whole of the back of the room through the tunnels. Then if we walk around the other side of the room, we have a pet carrier made into a hidey box full of straw for them to nest in and chew. We have a display of apple twigs, which are very exciting and perfectly safe for them to chew and gnaw on. There are various cardboard castles on the market, giving them somewhere to hide. Here you have safe wood again to gnaw on and then we have a whole warren set of tunnels so the rabbit can go through that tunnel get into there go around there get into that one over there and this is a very exciting idea this is a couple of small garden bags only 99p each with the bottoms cut out and they make brilliant tunnels we then have the rabbit's litter tray, a nice large one with a lip so it can't spill out. And all around there's hay for the rabbit to eat while they poo. We've got some Timothy hay there, varieties of hays. And then though we don't always recommend dog crates because the rabbit cannot hide, but this dog crate has been made into a big burrow. Again, maybe better for the two kilogram rabbits and a slightly different design for larger bunnies. But you can see all the edges have been protected with wood. There's even two little, in a, in a natural warren in the wild, rabbits would have more than one exit. So to help prevent fighting and make them feel safer, here you've got one, two, three exits and entrances. And inside, simply by using cardboard boxes, you've got one, two, three levels and a couple of ramps and shelves. And though you have to be careful rabbits don't fall, they do love to jump and hide and have different levels and sit up high and watch the world go by. So I hope this hopefully depicts um, a really exciting domestic rabbit warren, an exciting environment if you have got house rabbits rather than allowing the rabbit and forcing the rabbit to live in a human environment with nothing to do and nowhere to hide. Thank you.